Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game from Scratch, and it is a Tuesday. You regulars know what that means. 50-50 chance that you are getting free game dev assets today from Epic Games, and today we are in luck. <laughs> One of these days I'm going to do this video on a Tuesday where we're not getting anything, and I'm going to say, oh, too bad, it's so sad. But nope, this week we are getting three free assets, and you may notice on my thumbnail I have multiple game engine logos. Well, there's a reason for that. There's actually two reasons for that. This first one you see, this is one of the assets. This is like cyber warfare or something to that effect and uh basically it's uh it's cable although here you can see like a little bit of the the face mask you see all the time in uh cyberpunk 2077 so number of different accessories to go together to create this fellow let's go ahead and check out the animation here you're also going to notice here with the teleport and like the, the the virus things going on here he also kind of reminds me of cable from uh x-men so here let's go see what this looks like so here you can see uh, animations running, you can see the special effect as he comes through his portal, like so, and various different walk animations, punch animations, and so on for this character. Now, this one is available for every game engine. Yes, pretty much every game engine under the sun, FBX, uh, Maya is in there, Unity, Unreal, Native projects as well. So, this one you can use, uh, you can use it in Godot, you can use it in Default. This is why you want to be hoarding these assets every single week. You got two weeks to pick these assets up, by the way, uh, and if at the end of that two weeks you have not done so, well, you missed out. So, even if you are not using Unreal right now, hoard these. Now, here we are in what I would call the most cinematic of the options here. This is Lake Town. So, again, uh, another environment, heavily modular in nature, so you can turn this into a number of different environments over here. Where'd the moon go? Anyways, I want to show you something else in terms of why you should be hoarding these. Even if you are not using Unreal Engine, uh, as has become tradition, here is the asset exported over to the Godot game engine. So if you need, obviously the lighting is very different, but you can see how usable these are. So if you need yourself um, assets for other engines, pick these up. You can export them. The guides are down below on how I got this guy out. It is a very simple process. In this particular case, I used the Unreal to Godot plugin. It got the water. It did not get the snow. So it's not going to get 100% of everything. And obviously, different game engines have very different lighting. Uh, but it gives you a lot of ability to bring out uh, static meshes and scenes. Uh, so you get an idea of what this is all about. This is actually a pretty straightforward asset. Let's go take a quick look at the overview here. Um, so... Yeah, there you see. So the various different uh, buildings that went together to create this guy over here. And all the bits and bobs and stuff that go with it. I don't think there are interiors. No, no interiors here. Uh, but otherwise, yeah. So if you need like a uh, fishing or uh, otherwise village, that is what this one is all about. And then we got one last asset in the freebies list. This one is Chaotic Sky. So let's go ahead and check that one out. Uh, so let's do without terrain on the demos. And there's six of these. They're basically sky maps. Uh, you can see, again, here is one of them. Uh, next up, we have another one. So very uh, angsty, angry-looking skies going on. Uh, and then over here, we have another one, like so. And then we have a couple more. Here is another one. And then here is another one. And then here is the final one. So you see like there, boom, there you go. So I think, by the way, if you're using these in another engine as well, super easy export in this case because it's down to the textures. So come back here, chaotic skies, textures. Uh, then you want to go to the skies and you can see them all available here as built-in textures. Just come on up here, asset actions, export, and you can save these things out as an image file, use them in other engines, and so on. So that is it, Chaotic Skies as well. So quick recap of what we have this week. Uh, let's go to the beginning. So we have the Futuristic Warrior. By the way, you're going to get a choice of versions between Standard and Pro. Doesn't matter. That is just to determine how much you would have to pay if you were buying it yourself. But since Epic Games are picking up the price tag, eh, doesn't matter to you. Pick whichever one applies. You can see that, like I said, this is available for everything. Uh, Unreal Engine, Unity, FBX, and then a GLTF and GLB format, ZBrush, and Object as well. So you can use this wherever you want. Uh, on top of that, we have Lake Town. This is the one you saw exported out to run in the Godot game engine as well. So if you are looking for a medieval port fishing village type environment, modular setup for doing exactly that kind of creation. Again, 
me an idea of what it is all about. And you also saw how easily it was exported out to other engines. Check out the guides down below for details on doing that. And then our final freebie this month is this guy right here. This is the matte painted skybox pack for chaotic skies. And again, it's a number of uh, different maps that were created. Um, so again, details here. Pack has six movie quality, high resolution, 4K, 360 degree matte paintings. It can be used to enhance your environments and give a cinematic look. The source folder also has the original height mapped raw and heat map files. So you don't even have to export them out. They're just there for you. So if you want to have these very dramatic sky boxes for your game, well, that's what this pack provides. Nice looking stuff uh, on the whole, and it's kind of interesting. We haven't actually seen uh, any skyboxes yet, I don't think, um, in, in the giveaways so far. So as I always ask, what do you think of this month's freebies? Again, you have two weeks, so two weeks from today uh, to pick them up. You buy them for free. Once you purchase them, they are yours to keep forever. So let me know what you think. Comments down below. I will talk to you all later. Goodbye.